mechanisms to hold the Justice Department accountable, to conduct oversight. So the court obviously is going to have a lot of questions about this because prosecutors obviously do not resign every day, especially in circumstances like this. So I think the judge is entitled to really ask some probing questions about what the heck happened here. The inspector general, I would expect to take a look at this. And Congress, I mean, I think the attorney general really has an obligation to go up in front of the Judiciary Committees of the Senate and the House and explain what the, ha what the heck happened here. I could just interject. Look, I agree completely with Kerry. While I'm proud of the process, prosecutors and I think that did the right thing. This is a bad day for the Justice Department. And part of me, look, I mean, I think everybody knows the president is going to pardon Roger Stone. Just do it. Like, just do it now. Don't wait till the day after the election when you're probably going to do it. It's better to, you know, frankly, abuse that power, uh, the pardon power, than, than trash the Department of Justice. So I would say just, just, Mr. President, just go ahead and pardon him. Just, just jump to what we all know is going to happen. I want to bring in Ellie Holmes.